The Oprah Winfrey Show, broadcast from Chicago and moderated by Oprah Winfrey, was the highest rated TV show of its kind for 25 years between 1986 and 2011. But Oprah Winfrey was not just a normal TV celebrity, she is a fantastic leader too. So watch this video until the end to find out why. Hello, my name is Armin L. Rao and I'm the founder of A. Leonard Rao, the Entrepreneur's Entrepreneur. I've been a leader, coach and entrepreneur for some 20 years and I would like to help you to become a great leader. This video is about Oprah Winfrey and what we can learn from her, so watch it till the end. If you don't want to miss any content on Leadership for Entrepreneurs, subscribe to my channel by just clicking the red button below this video. For those of you who don't know Oprah Winfrey, Oprah, as they, as she is normally called in the media and everywhere. She was born on 29th of January 1954 and uh, she is a TV moderator, actress, entrepreneur, philanthropist. Yeah, that's what she is. She is best known for her TV program, The Oprah Winfrey Show, that ran from 1986 till 2011. But she's a great leader too. And I'd like to present three traits or three things about her where I believe we can learn something as entrepreneurial leaders. Number one, edutainment. Oprah was actually one of the first, or maybe the first, moderator <clears throat> or TV celebrity who combined education with entertainment. So uh, after a certain while she integrated more and more interesting and uh, educating contents into her show and made it possible to transfer that education in an entertaining way. So that's edutainment. Now, how about thinking about your business as an entertainment for your customers or an edutainment? What could be entertaining for your customers and how could you do that? That might be something that is inspiring for us all to see business more as entertaining and more as fun for you, for your employees and for your customers, even though at the end of the day we're talking about serious content products and services. Secret number two of Oprah is value add. So if you look at what she does, she's always looking in to add value to people's, people's lives, to her businesses, to her clients, to the people watching her show or programs. So ed entertainment is good, but at the end of the day in business, if it is entertainment, if it is entertaining, always make sure that you're all also delivering value because without the value that your customers can benefit from, the whole entertainment doesn't really matter. So combine entertainment with value. Second principle, value add. Number three, what we as leaders can learn from Oprah is a serving attitude. So she interprets herself always as serving a bigger cause and you will see once as an entrepreneur and a leader you come to that conclusion that you're not really working for yourself but for others and you are here to give that will make your life as an entrepreneur and as a leader much more fulfilling so let's look at Oprah in her show she gave for example LGBT people a platform to express their positions and to get heard in society. Furthermore, what she does, she offers solutions to problems that really help people and that is obviously a giving attitude and a serving attitude. And look at herself, look at, look at herself, look at her curriculum. She was molested as a child. She became involuntarily pregnant at the age of 14, could not spend a formal or normal family life with her 
mother and father and she overcame that and decided to give and to help other people not to be in the same situation which again is serving attitude and to overcome these obstacles and give to others so number three serving attitude so what can we learn from Oprah Winfrey as leaders the first one was edutainment think about your business as entertaining in the truest sense of the world people second combine the entertainment with a value add and Number three, let's never forget that we are here to serve. We are not here for ourselves and we are not here to become the greatest of all. That is certainly uh, not <clears throat> the right way to look at things, at least from my humble point of view. And that's what we can learn from Oprah Winfrey. I would like to conclude with three things um, for you ask how your products or services can be more entertaining, as I said before, add value and serve. If you start looking at your business the Oprah way, you will most certainly be more successful. And the life program gives you the means to become a great leader within weeks. So if you like this channel or if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave a comment please and um, Come back, I'm really happy to have you and I'm so happy to, to serve and to share my points of view uh, and my experience with you entrepreneurs out there. See you next time. This is Armin Rao from A. Leonard Rao, the entrepreneur. And don't forget, lead yourself.